Welcome back to Living 808. The Honolulu Japanese Chamber of Commerce has been going strong for 120 years. Yeah, we learned about its history and what's ahead for 2020. The Honolulu Japanese Chamber of Commerce celebrates its 120th anniversary in 2020. We were organized in 1900 and we have a very interesting story of how it started. Uh, at that point in time, many of the immigrants, business immigrants, had their stores in Chinatown. At that time, uh, the uh, entire Chinatown area burned down. So from that, the Japanese immigrants got together and created the Honolulu Japanese Chamber. At that time, it was called the Honolulu Merchants Association that became the Honolulu Japanese Chamber. Uh, and uh, it's been growing since that period, and uh, we have had uh, many milestones thereafter, such as in 1988, we created the Culture Center of Hawaii. Uh, the property that Japanese Culture Center is situated was once the property of the Japanese Chamber. And we deeded over the property to create the Culture Center. And uh, presently, we are just a tenant in the facilities that is basically now run by the Japanese Culture Center. All the tenants in the facilities now are pretty much other Japanese-related organizations. So the concept was to build a culture center, get as many of the Japanese organizations together, and work together to promote the Japanese philosophy and culture throughout uh, Hawaii and hopefully the world. To celebrate the 100th anniversary, what we did was we constructed the Tori Gate, which uh, if you pass by the Mo'ili'ili area, it's situated on the Mo'ili'ili Triangle Park. Uh, we raised the money and we had it built here. Uh, and the money primarily came from the Hiroshima government and the Hiroshima Chamber. And what's interesting about the story of the Tori Gate, it's the exact replica of the Tori Gate that sits out on Miyajima Island in Hiroshima. And uh, it's a scaled down model. Uh, but what's also interesting is it is made up of pure titanium. So it will last a lifetime. And we painted it, so now it looks as though it's a wooden structure, but it's really not. And uh, we are now responsible to maintain the Tori Gate and we've had to paint it every 10 years. And we've been able to raise the money to uh, maintain the Tori Gate during this period. Um, one of the key benefits that kind of differentiates our chamber from other chambers is we really like to stress business to business. So we have a theme B2B. Um, one thing we do with our new members is we have our orientation we introduce the different programs for the members. Um, also, we encourage them to get active and join different of our committees that we do have. And by joining the committees, they'll start networking, meeting other members. Um, and that's probably one of the biggest benefits is the, the relationships. And as you build these relationships, you have opportunities to grow your business. And also, our chamber offers some of the most talented members. So if you need an attorney, a realtor, um, you pretty much will find it with our chamber membership. The reason people should join is the relationships that you get. And it ends up being a lifetime relationship. Um, we do projects together. We end up going out to dinners together. We celebrate New Year's together. Um, and that's so important. You know, it, it, again, it's a lifetime. If you ever need help, you know, the members will come out and support you. You know, you drive by all the time. There's so much great work and cultural and connections you can make there. Like they said, if you need just about anything, a great networking system. So younger, all ages there, it is a great community to be a part of. And of course, they host so many great events in that building as well. That's so awesome. And it's good to know that they're, like they said, that they're always going to be there for you. And mm -hmm. just like you said, like it's that community environment. So, all right. Well, coming up.